mostly my course of preparation was speed i watched all the videos this time i completed the mcqs and uh, tried to give most of the grand tests and all the tests that were there so this has helped me immensely i bring in all the wishes and greetings on behalf of all the faculty members of speed medical institute to dr chandrani chatterjee for scoring a topmost rank of aml 6 in dm respiratory medicine group for dm pulmonology as a super specialty in any ss session number 2025 congratulations to you Thank you sir. Great to have you in the session today and thanks for your time to share your experiences with us. And can we know your brief background from where you started till date what all you have done? Uh sir I did my MBBS from Medical College Kolkata. Then I did my post graduation in respiratory medicine from Calcutta National Medical College and now again I'm senior resident at Medical College Kolkata. Very good. Excellent. Great accomplishment. Very happy happy for you. <laughs> Thank uh, you sir. Kolkata is such a beautiful place with lot of Yes sir. tradition maintained <laughs> in a great way and also the respiratory medicine is very huge uh, specialty center as kolkata as, as a whole yes sir and great now can we know why a dm as a super specialty because i mean md pulmonary medicine itself is an end specialty why at all we uh, need to uh, dm super specialty how when you got this interest uh, sir it actually depends on uh, individual interest we may or may not do a uh, dm uh, because uh, by it itself we are getting the md respiratory medicine degree but the thing is that respiratory medicine is such a vast subject and it is an expanding subject so every day new and new things are coming up and i developed interest in the branch when i was studying my md and i thought that i should further learn more about the branch that's why i wanted want to do dm excellent very very happy for you and thank uh, you sir and once you decided to do dm what all you did to achieve this topmost rank what is your preparation strategy how many hours you worked is a full time or part time can you share something on that uh, yes sir since i was working as a senior resident and i was uh, also doing a uh, part time uh, practice so uh, i did not get much time also sir you have already taken my video in the la- uh, my interview in the last session i got a rank of 59 in the last neat ss could not do as well in the inss got a rank of 52 so i decided to not take a seat in that session and that's why i started preparing mostly my uh, source of preparation was speed i watched all the videos this time i completed the mcqs and uh, tried to give most of the uh, grand tests and all the tests that were there and uh, hence uh, i could uh, gauge as to where i was in my preparation so this has helped me immensely along with the seeing the patients clinically in our opd our faculties they are always there to help us so in that way i prepared excellent excellent now so you decided to go your uh, dm super specialty with the institute yes so you were more towards your institute uh, rather than going into the neat ss uh sir not exactly uh, neat ss has a certain obligation of bonds at certain place and i did not want to get into another bond since west bengal is already having three years of bond so yeah. that's why i did not pick up good you decided to do what is comfortable for you that is very very important. yeah yes sir yes uh, very good now can we know how many number of questions you attended can you say something about the paper can you share something about the paper yes i attempted 76 questions around then uh, in it i felt that most of them were pulmonary medicine questions which were of moderate level few were medicine questions uh, which were answerable if we also uh, study the medicine uh, a medicine part that is there in speed it covers it well and also some uh, aspect of biostats was also there so i would say to everyone to not uh, neglect biostatistics because almost four to five questions are always there from biostats it plays a huge uh, impact on your rank because if you are studying for uh, pulmonary medicine most of you will get all the questions correct but if you can also answer the medicine part and the biostats part that, that will actually amplify your rank very good excellent Now, uh, interview. How did you prepare? What were the areas of interview? What did they ask you? Can you share something on the in- interview? Ah, uh, sir, they did not take my interview for a long time. It was around six to seven minutes. They asked all aspects, as in uh, my first question was, how will you manage a patient of lung cancer that has come to you in the emergency department? What are the non-respiratory complications of lung cancer? Then they also asked me about bit about critical care, as uh, what is SIMV mode. what is the cycling mode in pressure support ventilation they asked me a bit of bronchogenic cis then some aspects of tb were also asked it was not a very difficult uh, thing if we always if we 
cover our theory properly, then we can easily answer it. Very nice. Very nice. Now, what is the message that you want to give for the future aspirants of DM Pulmonology? I would love, just want to say that get your uh, concepts clear. Your basics should be rock solid. And up, after clearing your basics, you have to also uh, strategize as to how to approach a question because however much you study, you will not know everything. So you have to have an approach towards a question and you, everybody has their own approach and they can develop it as they practice the MCQs. And watching the videos, wherever you get stuck is also very important. Great. Now, time to thank and whom all you want to thank that you feel that they helped you to I mean, achieve what we are today. <laughs> uh, first of all, my parents, my uncle, uh, my cat for always being there <laughs> by my side. Uh, her name is Ria, by the way. And uh, my friends, particularly Shubhashish and Shine, I, we used to do group study. So it was very, very helpful. And they were always by my side. A few of my colleagues, such as uh, uh, Shantan and uh, my teachers, my HOD, Shubham Mr. Sir, Shelly Shamim Sir, Nuthi Madam, and my current institute faculty, Dr. Shivesh Sir, and then Shubhashaji Sir and Prabhup Sir. All of them have helped me immensely during my preparation. And of course, last but not the least, speed app. It has been the foundation of my studies. Great, Doctor. Wonderful to have you in the session. You shared some valuable experiences and inputs for the students to prepare for uh, DM. Alumnology superficiality. We once again wish you all the very best and all the success for a great and wonderful career in the institute. In your Thank you, sir. Deep speciality of your choice of DM Alumnology. Best wishes. Thank you.